this is a, a solution that we are selling since 2023 and uh, we have uh, in stock the whole the whole components so the solution is available ready to sell it's uh, a scalable solution and this this motor and this uh, uh, controller can provide uh, uh, starting 2.5 kilowatt at uh, 24 volt and increasing the voltage of the battery you can reach up to 6 kilowatt and uh, of course the speed of the motor will go up with that uh, but it's we sold it for 36 volt, uh, volt application and uh, mainly 24 in this case it's for a winch which is going to be placed on a crayfish boat and uh, we opted for a small compact power pack that's the nice thing of this motor we can fit it on uh, every power pack we have uh, because it's it's been fitted with a 80 90 uh, frame flange so it can fit on any standard power pack this is 12 volts for the controller and instead this is the voltage for the power and it's in this case it's a battery which you could see down there it's uh, 150 amp hour so basically at the standard working power maximum power it can work for one hour and a half so the idea is that they can uh, bring up 150 kgs every single day without recharging and anyway there will be a charger which will charge while the boat is moving around so as all uh, brushless motors we can control the speed and we can just give it a run to see the sound of it and see some numbers flowing it's not optimized of course because the power pack is very high uh, pressure drop but for what we need is uh, sufficient what we've done for the customer we put together all the electronics on one plate which they can stick on the wall nearby the power pack they can also stick the power pack somehow in, in, even in vertical and then they will place on the wall near the winch the controls in this case we put here the speed control start and stop and the emergency button so let's pretend this is on on the on the wall we start it at minimum speed we just limited not zero but a minimum speed uh, so this zero is corresponding to 3.4, 3.5 liter per minute. We can simulate here the load. Okay, at low speed, of course, uh, the flow will drop below the capacity of the flow meter. Now we'll increase the flow until we get some speed. Okay. So maximum flow will be around 9-10 liters and now you see the motor tries to keep the flow steady. It will work around 100-120 bar and you can feel that the motor is compensating so the more I put pressure is increasing the, the torque and you see even increasing the torque again is around five liters still five liters and with this we can change the speed yeah the the, the power pack is connected to the battery and we can check the consumption with an app this particular battery is a bluetooth so here we can get uh, the charge which is 90 percent it will say with the the actual consumption of 2.4 kilowatts we have one hour and a half autonomy so we can run for one hour and a half at full power and uh, it tells you also the temperature and the amps we can increase the pressure of course now the flow is reduced because it's flowing through the relief that's the other limitation of the power pack the relief is entering a bit earlier but still we are running even with partially open we are running at 7 liter per minute and you see 2.4 2.5 kilowatt absorbed there so it's 
you know, it's a simple solution, but uh, very effective for this kind of application. We leave this because the, the operator will tune if the winch is too fast. He can tune the speeds. Okay, and that's it.